This is your News 4 update, powered by the Bomarito Automotive Group. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for choosing News 4. I'm Claire Kellett. Here are some of the stories making headlines right now. Today, new coronavirus restrictions go into effect for seven counties in the Metro East. All restaurants and bars must close at 11 p.m. Reservations will be required to go to restaurants and bars. All reception halls will be closed and gaming halls and casinos must close at 11 p.m. as well and they are restricted to 25 percent capacity. Health officials say they will track the positivity rate for at least two weeks before deciding when to relax the restrictions. Today is the first day of school for more than 6,000 Metro East students. As your back to school authority, News 4 is tracking a big change for some of those students. Yesterday, the Collinsville number 10 district switched to remote learning due to a rise in COVID cases among staff members. High school and middle schoolers will start remote learning today. Kindergarten through sixth grade are still meeting their teachers today, and then they will start remote learning on Thursday. News 4 watching out for your drive. The MLK Bridge in downtown St. Louis will be back open tomorrow. The bridge closed for two years, so crews could perform extensive repairs to ramps and roadways. The reopening was delayed several times, mostly recently due to flooding. For a quick check of the forecast, we send things now. Meteorologist Kent Dearhart. Hope everybody's had a chance or will get a chance to enjoy cooler and less humid weather out there today. Really nice weather through Friday to look forward to. And the heat and humidity return a little bit as we head into the weekend. Maybe even a little bit of a rain chance, which we'd have today as well. 82 degrees for the high, maybe a spot shower in the eastern part of the viewing area. but. Northerly winds are pushing in that drier air. You can see the super predictors. We go through the afternoon trying to generate a shower or two in the eastern part of the viewing area. This is all on the backside of a low pressure system that continues to glide to the east. It's over southern Indiana now. Uh, and as it continues to exit the area and move away, it's going to take this rain chance with it so that overnight tonight things will clear out and you have even better weather to look forward to tomorrow. 81 degrees with even lower humidity. The tomorrow is when it bottoms out. If you keep track of dew points, dew points will drop into the 50s tomorrow. It's really going to be nice. 83 on Thursday with sunny skies. Friday looks really good as well with a high of 85 degrees. It does heat up as we head into the weekend, closer to normal, upper 80s to near 90 degrees, maybe a spot shower or two, but the weather continues to look pretty good even into next week. Kent, thank you, and that is your News 4 update. Remember, we are always online at KMovie.com and your KMovie News app.